So the first thing you need to do is to go over to your effects library and search for the lens flare effect. Now drag this lens flare effect onto your video clip over here. Now move over to your effects control panel over here and select the lens flare. And if I fit this back, you can find this blue arrow over here. So what I'm going to do is to fit this back to 100. Now next thing you need to do is to move this circle down to where you have your wand over here. And if you cannot see this circle, all you need to do is to select the lens flare in effect control and it's going to pop up. So come over to your blend with original over here and increase it so that you can see the wand properly. Now what you're going to do is to add a keyframe next to flare center over here. And as you can see the cross arrow here has gone so you need to select lens flare again to make it pop up and move one frame forward and move the cross arrow back to the wand and we're going to repeat this process throughout the entire clip. Once done, change the preview back to fit and change the blend mode with original back to zero. And as you can see, we have created this Harry Potter text wand effect. And if you want to off the lens flare at any position, what you can do is to move to the position where you want to off the lens flare and select the stopwatch next to blend with original over here and move one or two keyframes forward and increase the blend with original. And if we go back now and hit play, you can see how we switched off the lens flare at that position. Thank you for watching this tutorial and see you in my next video tomorrow.